Hi everybody. This is video uh, is going to be about the $95 guitar sale. Now in this video I'm just going to show you several guitars. If you would like a specific guitar to be analyzed a little deeper you can request that I send photos and I can take a bunch of stills of that guitar and give you some information on it. But you can know this about all the guitars that I have for sale. If they are not done with a factory finish, they're going to be done with one of my finishes, which by no means is going to compare with a factory finish. You're not going to have that ultra gloss look in your mirror kind of finish. They're going to be as is, but also know this. Every guitar that I have worked on will have upgraded tuners, upgraded electrics, and upgraded pickups. They will all have mag... Alnico. <laughs> Sorry to say magnesium. Yeah, we got magnesium pickups now. New thing. Now, they're all going to be Alnico pickups, unless it's a Gibson of some sort, and then I can't guarantee it'll have what it has. Uh, or Epiphone. I'm not selling any Gibsons, but Epiphone. I've got a couple, maybe a little SG specials and Les Paul specials and whatnot. But you can rest assured that they will have Alnico, upgraded electrics, and upgraded tuners. That's the first thing I do when I get a guitar. And I've just got so many guitars, I've got to move some out. $95 plus your shipping. Um, let's get started on that. This is the Barnyard Telecaster that I recently did a video on. It has got a set neck, got a DiMarzio and a Seymour Duncan pickup, galvanized bridge. It's got Squire tuners. Next, I have what I call Blackie. The black Stratocaster Squire, and if you can zoom in on the neck, I put a little blackie. See the cigarette burn there by the tuner, the marks on the guitar, just to kind of sort of be like blackie. Next is what I call the Wild Blue. This has got uh, P90 single coils in it. Aftermarket tuners and a squire neck of some sort, don't know exactly. Rosewood. Okay, the next is a green sparkle sunburst. Got Alnico pickups. And the head and the neck are both stained this color. And as you can see when it comes into focus that it is a smokestack custom body that I did. Brass nut on that one as well. And in the fifth one here is a little SG Epiphone special that I made up. I put some tuners on it. These are uh, vintage style like a Klutzen tuner that would be like on a Gibson. Um, there is a little bit of a uh, uh, you ask for pictures on this I'll show you what's what on it. The next one is kind of a blue metallic with a blue perloid pit guard and uh, keep in mind that all these bodies that I have are full thickness. This one has an affinity neck on it but this is not an affinity guitar but it is an affinity neck. Next we have a blackout. The black squire got, uh, as far as I can remember, it's got Alnico single coils and what kind of humbucker, I don't know. 
and I'd have to take it apart and find out. But there it is a Squire Strat neck, all stock. It's got the Squire tuners on it though. And this one I call Sugar Plum because I did it kind of in a funky purple and red. I thought it looked like a plum. Got Alnico pickups, full thickness body, and on the headstock. Come into focus. There we go. Sugar Plum. And last but not least is. Well, wait a minute. I've got two more here. There's one that I did kind of a funky paint job on. It was a black squire. I did a weird little paint job on it, but it's got Alnico pickups, modified electrics, just like all the others. This one has no markings on the head. It was probably a squire neck that I raced it. Okay, and last but not least, a lot of you have seen the, uh, there's actually a demo out on this one, the Bullfrog. And it is done in the Smokestack series. I made about five of these guitars that were called Smokestacks. That's the way that is. Now, total I have ten guitars that I'm going to try to sell for $95 plus shipping. You want pictures? I'll get you pictures. You tell me which guitar you want to look at and I'll get close-ups. Thank you for your time.